This video is the second in a series of three in which we explore the purpose, key components and architecture of a computer system. In this video, we take a look at the common CPU components and their function. Here we see an abstraction of a computer system. The boundaries of the computer system are represented by the blue shaded box. We can see the computer accepts inputs from, say, a keyboard and a mouse, and provides output from, say, a monitor and speakers. The two main internal components of the computer that we're interested in here are the central processing unit, the CPU, and main memory, RAM. Let's take a look inside the CPU and see what it's made up of. One important component is the arithmetic logic unit. This is responsible for carrying out calculations and making logical decisions. Another important component is the control unit. You can think of this as the command and control center of the CPU. It sends signals to control how data moves around the CPU and coordinates the CPU's operations. Next is the cache. This is a small amount of very fast memory, which is typically located either very close to or actually inside the CPU itself. Its purpose is to provide fast access to frequently used instructions and data. Information fetched or written to cache is done much quicker than information fetched or written to main memory. Finally, we have the registers. These are super fast pieces of onboard memory inside the CPU and each has a very specific purpose. CPUs have many different types of dedicated registers. The four you need to know about at GCSE are the accumulator, the memory address register, the program counter and the memory data register. And we take a look at the, those in more detail in the next video. Let's just recap what we've covered in this video then. The CPU consists of the following components. The arithmetic logic unit, which performs calculations and logical divisions. The control unit, which sends signals to control how data moves around the CPU. Cache, providing fast access to frequently used instructions and data. And registers, tiny, super fast pieces of onboard memory inside the CPU, each with a very specific purpose. <laughs>